Hello and welcome back to the Cascade Subdivision. In this video, I am going to talk about weathering trucks on your locomotives. Here we're starting with the Tamiya panel liner. This is just applied uh, as a shadow layer over the whole truck. And I am uh, just putting this in all of the different seams and cracks and crevices. This will settle in and dry and create a nice base or uh, some lighter colors to go over and make sure that those details uh, stand out a little bit. So I do this on both of the trucks, just the applicator that comes with the, uh, the bottle of panel liner it works great for this. You can see the truck on the left is drying up a little bit as I apply the fresh layer. Now we're gonna move on and apply some color this is a craft acrylic called Ice Coffee. It's really just a dark tan. I really like this color. It, it dries up in kind of a tan gray color. You can see here I'm applying it with a uh, little bit thinner brush so I can work it into all the different cracks and crevices. I've thinned down the paint a little bit, uh, kind of right in between out of the bottle and a thin wash. So it's right in the middle there, a little milky but allows for good coverage, flows really well, but I uh, won't totally obscure the, uh, the silver color of the truck underneath. Just put a nice layer on top and just work it into uh, all the different areas around the, uh, the truck itself. And I come back with a second layer just in a few areas. You can see how that initial application of the panel liner still shows through and then some of the dark shadows coming through now we're going to go to a second color this is a burnt umber any dark brown or brown color or whatever you see in the prototype photos that you're working with this one i do apply a little bit more like a wash so it's quite thinner um, and we're just looking to get that that dark brown dirt grime tint kind of all over the truck. And you can apply this and you know, it doesn't have to be a uniform layer. It can be, you know, over just one of the axles or whatever works best for uh, your model. All this is thinned with water, so it's super easy to work with, super easy to clean up. And then in between layers, I dry with a hairdryer. And there's the finished truck. You can see the uh, panel liner coming through really well and those uh, those subtle colors that I put in. All right, thanks for watching.